Happy Cinco de Mayo, guys. Uh, I wanted to come today and share a video with you guys. It's been a couple weeks since we last posted our video. Uh, this week, we're going to talk about the Merit Chart. The Merit Chart is a very uh, awesome and amazing chart that gives a lot of information. This is not just a chiropractic chart. This is actually in every medical textbook, uh, anatomy textbook that goes over anything related to bodily function. And the cool part is this essentially shares what uh, your nervous system is connected to. It pretty much tells you that the nervous system is supplied by, you know, or supplies these specific areas, and if you have certain symptoms or conditions, where they may fall as in regards to the spine and actual nervous system. The cool part about this is a lot of patients lately have been coming in explaining of specific symptoms or conditions that they may be having, and I try to always relate it back to the nervous system because if you think about it, the nervous system is what runs and controls everything in our body every cell, tissue, organ in our body, for your heart to beat, for your lungs to breathe, for you to digest food, it must come from the nervous system. So I've circled and, and underlined a few symptoms and conditions, and uh, just to kind of start with headaches. A lot of patients complain of headaches or migraines. If you look at this chart, that is in this area, which is, correlates right back to your C1. That's the upper segment in your neck. Um, another big one really recently has been allergies or sinus infections. A lot of people said, oh, I just have sinus issues. I, you know, all of a sudden my nose is starting to run or I gotta blow my nose all the time. Well, look right here in this chart. That relates right back to the C2. That's also in the upper part of your neck. If we move on down, another one that most people don't even think of are thyroid issues. I know I've seen lots of patients and that's something they don't even really tell me about and we happen to find out through some other way and they say, yeah, actually I've been on thyroid medication for many, many years. And it's like, well, haven't you thought maybe your thyroid isn't functioning properly because there's an interference or your nervous system's being choked off and the thyroid can't function properly. So if you look here, thyroid relates right back to the C6, which is in the lower part of your neck. As we go down, this is a, a couple other big ones that patients talk to me a lot about, especially with kids, is asthma. Uh, asthma is a big one, especially like exertional asthma. You know, as kids start to run, they begin to cough and they have trouble breathing. That relates back in the upper thoracic area right here. And nowadays with that forward head posture, that tech neck that everybody is uh, dealing with, that's a big problem for kids because all of our kids have cell phones and they're on games all day long or on the iPad. And then as we go down, heartburn, indigestion, how many of us suffer with those issues, especially we can't eat certain foods or can't go to, to eat a spicy meal because we we'll end up having heartburn and have to take an antacid. Well, if we look at the T6 area, more than likely there's something going on there that's actually interfering with the nervous system. And let's keep going down. Chronic infections. But you know what I really wanted to talk about was IBS, Crohn's disease, uh, constipation, diarrhea. Those things are big, big issues that a lot of people are scared to even share with or they don't think to tell the chiropractor about it. And that's a very important issue for me to know because that's gonna let me know what is not functioning properly, what is not working properly. And if you have one of those issues, more than likely it's coming from the upper lumbar segments around L1, L2 area. And then as we go down, for women especially, this is Mother's Day weekend, so this is our Mother's Day month, and uh, obviously a big focus is on the moms. Menstrual trouble, menstrual cycle issues, again, that's something that most patients aren't gonna tell you about, especially a chiropractor. That's something we need to know about because more than likely there may be something that's uh, being affected or interfered with and that's what we wanna help you with. So aside from just sharing the Mary chart, what I also wanted to do was go over a few different ways on how we adjust patients and different uh, methods on how it can be done. It is easy, it is safe, it's gentle, but yet very, very effective, especially at helping with specific symptoms or conditions. So, um, what we're going to do is we're going to focus on the hips and lower back. So I'm going to show you a couple different ways on how I adjust to help people get the best results possible in our office. So the first thing we're going to do is work on uh, her hips. So I always just start by checking for movement, making sure that what is moving uh, is moving fluidly and what's not moving we need to begin to correct and work on. So both of her hips we're going to adjust. One is shifted down and one is shifted up. So I use a drop table. That gives me a, allows me to put some pressure without putting a lot of force on her body so she doesn't fight me. So I'm gonna go ahead and push the right hip up, the left hip down. It's as simple as just a little bit of a push. We're gonna do that a couple more times just to get the extra motion in there. Nice and easy, good. Perfect. 
Now we also want to go straight down and move on that sacrum just a little bit. So I'm just going to put some pressure straight down, just like that. We're going to do that two more times. Nice. And then the last one. Perfect. Um, so then I would also move all the way up the spine. Now, since we're sticking with the lower back, another way that we can adjust is what is called side posture. Anybody that's been to a chiropractor more than likely has had this adjustment at some point. Um, it does put a lot of release and pressure uh, off of the low back and on those uh, iliac joints. So I'm gonna have you put your left side up for me. Good. So you just lay on your side. Uh, you're gonna put your bottom leg straight. You're gonna bend your top leg. Perfect, and I'm gonna adjust your hands. Nice job. Now, I'm gonna put my leg over, and I'm just gonna simply put some pressure right here. I'm gonna come over and put that force right on that joint, just like that. Perfect, now let's go to the other side. Same thing, very similar. Nice, thank you. Perfect, same exact motion. Perfect, awesome, you can go back on your stomach. Well, she just got a great low back or hip adjustment and she's ready to go for the weekend. And so I wanted to share with you guys before we head out, uh, one of our specials that we're, we're giving out for the month of May is a $45 full consultation, comprehensive evaluation and examination and any x-rays that may be necessary to take for you to understand, do you have an issue that maybe we can help with? Is there something that your body is not expressing to its fullest capability? Well, this is gonna allow us to do that. We'll also use a, utilize a rock tape application which many Olympian uh, athletes and even pro athletes utilize, all for $45. But the cool part is, being that it's the month of May, if you're a mom or a mother-to-be, we'll still honor it and give you a $10 off, so that'll be $35 for the full uh, evaluation and any x-rays necessary. Uh, you can call us at 919-785-9191 or uh, email us at healthsource, H-E-A-L-T-H-S-O-U-R-C-E, -E, L-B-T, at gmail.com. Guys, have an awesome weekend, and can't wait to share the next video with you guys. Enjoy, take care. If we can answer anything, let us know.